Since being drafted into MLW in 2020, Jimmy Norp has become a staple of the league. Everything from his outgoing personality, the immaculate hair, and his talent on the wiffle ball field made him an instant fan favorite, and that momentum reached a peak in 2021 when Jimmy Norp had a landmark season and, in my eyes, cemented himself as a staple player on the nationwide tournament circuit. But today, let's talk specifics. Exactly how good was Jimmy Norp in 2021? Let's talk about it. At this point, you all know the story of the MLW Diamondbacks 2021 campaign. An 11-4 regular season record gave the boys a playoff berth. In the playoffs, they would start with a decisive two-game sweep of the Great Lakes Gators to enter the World Series facing the Wildcats, led by MLW legend Kyle Schultz. The best of five series would be an absolute dogfight all the way through, leading to a Game 5 in which Michael Shima would hit the walk-off to end the series, end the season, and make the Diamondbacks the MLW champions in 2021. Now, while every championship in sports history is a team effort not decided by one single player, for the sake of this video, I want to take a look at how Norp, by himself, contributed to their championship run. First of all, let's look at his stats at the plate. In the regular season, Norp led the team in average at 391, and on base percentage at 594, RBI with 34, and home runs with 11. Want to know the scariest part? Talk about clutch it up. Norp never let up in 2021 and also led all of these same batting categories for his team in the postseason. This is extremely impressive by itself, but I don't think his ability at the dish is the strongest part of Jimmy's game. To me, that title would go to his pitching ability. Combining his regular season and postseason stats, Jimmy Norp pitched to a 1.35 ERA over 46.2 innings, striking out 90 batters on his way to 11 wins as a starter. Norp's pitch selection and his ability to sequence his at-bats to always keep batters uncomfortable is outstanding. Besides this, Norp has the calm composure of an ace pitcher. He is extremely level-headed in intense situations and goes to work with ease. And it was this mental ability, as well as his on-field talents, that he was able to show the entire Whiffs world in 2021. In 2021, the MLW All-Stars attended two major tournaments on the nationwide tournament circuit. That would be the NWLA tournament in August and the United Wiffle Ball National Championship tournament in October. You know what? I feel like a lot of people doubt MLW when you come to tournaments like this. And we just moved on to tomorrow, and I mean, I feel like I pitched really well, I put the bat on the ball, and I mean, I clutched up there at the end, so I think actually that last game that I just played on this field right here, probably my proudest moment. Honestly, in that one clip, I think Jimmy kind of summed it up. In the past, when MLW has gone outside of their bubble, so to speak, they have been met with some skepticism across the competitive Whiffs world, and I think that 100% changed for the better in 2021. For one factor, I think Whiffs has seen a sense of unity in the past couple years that was really missing in the past decades where there was a lot of gatekeeping, but looking at it strictly from a competitive side, the MLW All-Stars just flat out played well this year. And I think Jimmy is owed a big part of that credit. At the NWLA tournament, Norp hit for an above 300 average with two home runs that helped lead his team to two wins and a top 12 finish. But at the United Wiffle Ball National Championship tournament is where he would really have his coming out party. Jimmy would have an impressive pitching performance, holding his own against the legendary franchise Whiff Inc. in MLW's first game in the tournament. And he would go on to show out his bat and defensive capabilities against some of the best talent in the country, which in turn led to a final 16 appearance on Sunday for the team. I think his performance as a part of the squad built a great showing and I can't wait to see the MLW All-Stars at more tournaments in the future. To close out the year and fill up the trophy cabinet, at the 2021 MLW Award Show, Norp took home League MVP, Cy Young, Most Clutch, Silver Slugger, and a Split Award, 
and gold glove. Yeah, I mean, you know, pretty decent to say the least. So looking back on the entire year, Jimmy Nort played incredible wiffle ball in his home league and abroad, showing himself to be an incredible talent and ambassador for whiffs. I had the pleasure of finally meeting Jimmy in person at UWIFs and can say he is as much of a pleasure to talk to off the field as he is to watch on it. Best of luck to you and your team in 2022, Jimmy, and hopefully our paths will cross again soon. And there you have it, guys, the Wiffle Statement look back on the landmark season Norp had in 2021. But what do you guys think? Am I being too generous or am I not giving enough credit? Let me know down below in the comments as well as other Wifflers you think had outstanding seasons in 2021 and who you think will be someone to look out for this upcoming season. As for myself, you guys know the drill. Please drop a like and subscribe for top tier content covering whiffs across the country. You can also follow me on Twitter at Wiffle Statement, where I am very active and plan to be throughout the season, so you will not want to miss out on that. Until next time, guys, get out there and play some whiffs, and I will be talking to you soon. Goodbye. <laughs>